Hello, boob tube. Or, oh, wait, YouTube. DJ Aaron here. I am shooting a video because it's like 3.50 in the morning. Uh, you guys didn't... 5.50 on the fucking east coast. Yeah. I'm here with uh, Zach and Comp Wiz. To, I just got done doing a late night edition of DJ Aaron Radio. And uh, I flipped Mark and Scruffy off. They didn't want to come in. They were just too pansy ass and too scared. Did they? I don't know. Don't have any They had the uh, piss up a rope and they also had the Mark's dog can kiss my ass thing. But that's not what this video is about. This video is about uh, the new build of Windows 10, the fall update, so to speak. So if we go in here and we type uh, winver and then run command, we can see the actual version. It is 5.11 and the build number is right there and it has a dot three on there. So that is interesting. And oh, look, we have uh, color title bars. Something that Microsoft added back in Windows. But you could still you could still have the white Windows if you uh, prefer. You just go you just go into your settings. And what you do, and move these crazy people out of the way. Zach's going to say, who are you calling crazy? Uh, I'm not really calling fucking crazy. But <laughs> and then... But he's just as fucking crazy, YouTube. I know, I'm, 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 I'm no better. So we, just, we go into uh, the personalization. I think that's what it is. And we go into colors. And we go show color on start, taskbar, action center, and title bars. We could turn that off, and we'll see what that does. Now, watch when we open a Win32 deal. See, you can change it back to the white border, like how it was in uh, 10 Now, let's just say you want to turn that back on. God, I really want to drag this window, but I can't. It's like on the... There we go. So what we can do, we could hit the toggle switch to back on. And see there is... Okay, there we go. There's the title bars. So, that's that. You have colored title bars now. So if you don't have this fall update, uh, check your Windows updates. Uh... For people who are using the 10240 build, uh, install it and see what you think. It's pretty cool. So, in the next clip, we're going to see what kind of changes they made to the start menu. Alright, I'm back and uh, I'm going to click the start menu. So, we're going to notice we're going to notice a few new things. Uh, all apps and then we're going to scroll down they added a couple new ones if I can ever get my cursor to do what it's supposed to um, we, we still have the normal crap that we have alright so we have Skype, Groove, Music, uh... Three, I'm running the latest build. We have, uh, Messaging, which is new. We have Microsoft Wi-Fi. Don't even know what that is. Um... We have... We have Phone. I believe we have Skype. We have Skype Video. Which is right there. Skype Video. And we have something called Sway. I don't even know what that is. 
Do you have any idea what that is, Zach? No, I'll have to look into that because I hadn't found it yet. So, what happens if we open the messaging? We're going to have to take a look at this. Where did you find Sway at, by the way? It's in the uh, start menu. Unfortunately, the messaging does not work, it looks like. Messaging works, have you? Okay, okay, it just had to take time to load. Okay, continue. And then we have Skype video as well. I guess this kind of works in conjunction, conjunction with uh, Skype. So, messaging and Skype. Um, both work together. Continue. I'm just going to wait a moment. Uh find friends on Skype do do this later uh, let's see uh, Sway is like a version of PowerPoint I see uh, let's say do this later why does it need a phone number what need the phone number the uh, the Skype video application I don't know but I I did it later. I just never did. And then we have... <laughs> I like how this is integrated with Skype. Because if you could see, that's the messaging app. We have Zach's mom. And we have... I'm going to do a test from the message app. And yes, I'm typing this into the group chat in case people are knowing. Or want to know this. Okay. Yeah. So I got right. it uh I got it synced the good up. Old battle of Kimmy Chong. So you saw you saw that test, right? Yeah. So it works. That's cool. Now if only that the uh Skype video will work with this. Uh it's like my kinda it don't as far as I can tell I can get that part to work. So this messaging is kind of like how uh, yeah, FaceTime yeah. and uh, whatever they use for messaging in Mac. This is kind of the same thing. Oh, Zach. Yeah. I have uh, two things down here. Phone and video. <laughs> oh, I test it and see which one works. I... I, I Pretty much can't because uh, because I got to drop out of the call and see if what see if something happens here. Okay, I'm going to drop out of this call. Damn it, Zach! You know you're on YouTube, right? <laughs> You'd be like, I don't give a shit. <laughs> you don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to drop out of this call and I'll pick up this clip when uh, I have success. <laughs> Zach, you pick your nose on fucking camera. I caught that. <laughs> of course, you don't give a shit. <laughs> You're giving the viewers what they want. Okay, YouTube, we're going to try this again. Zach's uh, going to uh, fix his camera and stuff. Okay, come on, Zach. <coughs> All right, here we go. Let's answer. Hey, this guy won't, won't let me use the it won't? goddamn camera, but oh well, it doesn't work. <laughs> hey, it works. <laughs> I, I guess I had to uh, do the, I guess I had to do the toggle switches in the settings. <laughs> I didn't have to do anything. It just worked out of the box. And I, and I told it to make Skype my default. Mm. <clears throat> make I the... don't normally use this camera, <laughs> YouTube. Uh, is it going in? Yeah. 
<laughs> Did Wiz go to bed or is he still? He still. I thought he might call him back. Yeah, I'll probably jump back on the de desktop client and just enter back yeah. into the group call. I think this is more for if you don't understand the. This is like the old Skype app. It's kind of a pain in the ass. Yeah, it's more like a, it's more like how Apple has FaceTime and crap. Yeah, it's micro, micro shaft. <laughs> it's micro shaft's version of uh, FaceTime. Uh huh. It works. Works. It's not using the right damn camera though. <laughs> but it, I ain't having it. Ain't, it micro shaft can't find their own micro shaft camera over it. <laughs> They gotta use my Logitech, which is there somewhere. I ain't there somewhere, YouTube. Zach, Zach's camera is always this camera is always being used for something, even for iVlog. That's fine. That's what it's for. But that was my main one over there. So that, that's crazy. Yeah. We gotta get the whiz set up with this. Ah, uh, he's got it, but but he won't. He won't like it. Let's see. I mean, it's good for one-on-one -on -one calls. Yeah. If you really want. No. Yeah. Nope. Can't add nobody to this call. Of course, so this. Life. So if I have freaking. Skype closed. Uh, you can still call. Yeah. So Skype is now mandatory on the machines now. Yeah, pretty much. But hey, at least this works and it's not broke. <laughs> yeah, it's not broke. I look freaking blue on this camera. <laughs> so what do you say we get back into the group call and... Works for me. Are you filming? Yeah, I'm filming. Alright. I'll talk to you in a minute, wherever the damn... Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll reopen the, the Skype desktop. Oh, the wherever desktop. the damn camera is. <laughs> so that's the... Uh, so this is Microsoft's version of kind of Skype video FaceTime kind of thing. So we're just going to close this out. We're going to close this out, and then we're going to open regular Skype back up. Now we're back on regular Skype. Uh -huh. We're just back on the regular desktop client now. Uh -huh. So, those two things are much like the, uh, like the Apple FaceTime and messaging thing. Yeah, it's uh, it uh, it uses Skype only basically. So you know, you could uh type in group chat, but you can't do group video though. That's that's the only downside. They need to make it to where you can do group video. True, but that probably won't happen. That's like that's like Apple using group video. In a way, they probably want to make the app kind of suitable to uh, what FaceTime was like. Yeah, that, they make it like the Skype cell phone app, too. Yeah. Bloody blows. But hey, it works. I mean, it's... It's, it's a piece of software that they've actually got working. It actually, it, actually, it works. I mean, it's... I mean, it's it's something that's not crap in any way. Uh -huh. So the next bit of software we're going to take a look at, guys, is we're going to take a look at... What's this phone thingy? That is for Skype, if I'm going to see here. Oh, that another oh. Skype thing? Uh, I'll see. Phone, where's that? Yeah, that's, that's your history of Skype calls and everything. 
basically the, the noise part of Skype, if, unless you want to do video. Oh, so just the, uh, the voice calls. Uh, okay, uh, so... So it just shows me the complete history, and then it brings up like a speed dial. That's cool. That's cool that they that they have for everything there. Uh, that's true. And then we have. Let's see. I want to go into all apps again. Then we have. Uh, what is it? Uh, it's called Microsoft Wi-Fi. Oh, where's that one? Let's find that one. I, I ain't let's, found that. Let's one. see what this is. Microsoft Wi-Fi. Get to online popular Wi-Fi locations such as hotels, etc. Okay, so that has to do with uh, like if you're out of town or something. It doesn't necessarily work for your home network. Ah. It's just for like additional, like uh, such as Wi-Fi in the hotels, airports, conference centers. Uh. Uh -huh. Oh, you have to pay for it. Yeah, and you read down there, and it says you can buy it from the Microsoft Store or whatever. It yeah. Don't but it's just, that, that's just telling you about it's all that does. Yeah, it's just something new that they just threw in there. And now we're going to check out this uh, Sway thing. It's kind of like PowerPoint, if I, from what I noticed when I looked at it a while ago. Ah, we have one new app for Office. Cool. Sway! Is this, like, free? Yeah, it's free. So I don't need to... So I don't need no. to do an account, do I? No, let me go back to the all apps. Scroll down to apps. Let's go next. Next. Get started. Uh-huh. So I want to... Oh, you could create a new... You could, uh... Import, example, the art film institute. Yeah. Fabric, fabric cam workshop Sunday, November 15th. I made climbing Mount Rainier. So basically, it's kind of like a <laughs> kind of like a version of PowerPoint. Uh -huh. It's pretty cool. So that was just some of the new things that I want to wanted to show you guys. YouTube. I probably will be doing more videos. On the new build of window or the new update of Windows 10 here very soon, but as it is right now, I'm starting to stumble with my words, and I probably need to go to sleep here pretty soon. But that is pretty much it for this video. Peace out, guys, and we'll see you all later.